It's Friday, or as we call it, Brew Day, a day where we get to find out more about local brews in town. Today's Brew Day is, brew day is sponsored by The Laughing Sun, and Mike joins us. Mike, we've been missing you because you've been out with Sarah, <laughs> but now you're back with us. Yeah, yeah, thanks for having me. I, I appreciate know. being back in studio. So. It's good to have you, as always, yeah. and you do have a featured brew, actually... A few that you brought us today. Yes. Yeah, I mean we've we brought out the flying our imperial version of flying axe called Axe King. Uh, this year it's a 10% version. Uh, last year we did it was about seven and a half. This year we kind of wanted to bump it up, do a special bottle release of it. Um, fun wax dip thing. Um, so yeah, come on down to the brewery. We got bottles for sale, and if you want to buy two, you get a discount on them with. Throw in the, the discount on a 19th Amendment chocolate berry stout if you're interested, or buy a couple and, and just get a discounted beer if you're interested on that. Um, but won't, they're a 250 bottle run, limited run, so we do have it on tap if you want to come down. 10% fun. It's really smooth though, so sneaky. Yeah, I was going to say, that's a big bottle, 10%. Make sure you have a ride home. <laughs> yeah, 750 milliliter, take it home and share it with someone. and Bring mm -hmm. a friend over, have a tasting event, um, make fun gifts, you know, for mm -hmm. sure. And you said, I mean, the Irish flag up here mm -hmm. in wax on top, kind of a good St. Patty's Day drink? Absolutely. Or? That's why we brought it out, inspired um, for that. So we released it the week right before St. Patty's Day, so it's fresh in the bottle. So, um, yeah, come on down and grab some before they're gone because they won't last long. So I've heard about this shrimp taco special. Mm -hmm. How long is that going on and, and what is it? That is through the end of the month, yeah. Okay. So we have we have shrimp in the house. Um, we did it kind of for Lent, but just for everybody that loves seafood like me. Um, mm -hmm. So shrimp tacos every day. You can add a shrimp skewer onto any of our entrees and stuff there for six bucks. Um, but yeah, shrimp tacos, three tacos, got some poblano corn elote on there, pickled jalapenos. Um, a little bit of the fish sauce that we put on there. It's a little spicy, but awesome. Um, yeah, I've eaten them probably 25 times in the last 35 <laughs> days or so. Yeah, um, they're delicious. I love shrimp tacos. Hey, yeah. you need to mix it up during Lent. Here's where you go on Friday. Go get some shrimp yeah, tacos. Yeah, absolutely. Right? No, um, yeah, we, and they're smoked on the smoker. So, yeah, mm -hmm. they come out fresh. They're, they're delicious. So. Oh, sounds so good. I love elote. My husband introduced me to that. So, so good. We're going to have to get some. Um, but you yes. always have such good live music also going on and big events. What can you tell us about what's coming up? Yeah, tonight we got, um, you know, speaking of hard things to say, I didn't want to <laughs> say it's like Dehemke with Ms. Mondegreen. Um, local talent there. Um, they'll be here tonight. Uh, tomorrow, Splash and Paper Chain traveling through the area um, on next Friday. Uh, Swen Tones will be here. Penumbra will be back on next Saturday. Um, the Greg Volker and the River will be on 4-5. Uh, on 4-6, we have um, all-day-long concert for Courage. That starts, I want to say, at 4 p.m., goes through 11. Um, yeah, come on down. Abuse Adult Resource Center uh, benefits that. Um, and ticketed show, anonymous phenomenon. Um, you're going to want to get that ticket before the day of the show because there will not be any left the day of the show. I can guarantee that. So um, get those beforehand. Um, yeah, 4 or 5 will be in Detroit Lakes for the craft beer tour coming up too. So um, if you're in the area, um, yeah. Come and see us in Detroit Lakes. You are always all over. I don't know how you keep your oh schedule straight. Like it's, it's calendar, Google yes, calendar. Yes, there you go. <laughs> Important, right? Yes. Okay. Well, Sarah has been excited about this Mother's Day 5K <laughs> that we've been talking about, yes. but now registration is open on the website. Registration is open. Go see us there. You can find it on our Facebook page, website, um, Instagram, all that kind of stuff. Um, yeah, hit us up. Uh, Obviously, I don't think we'll fill up with any. We don't have a set amount, but we're looking for as many people as we can. Benefits the Abuse, Ro Abuse Adult Resource Center. There will be a diaper drive um, going on at the brewery beforehand. So just trying to help moms out there on a good day, on a Mother's Day. So wonderful cause something to look forward to something mm -hmm. to train toward and then you can have a beer afterward when you cross the finish line watch babies race oh you can i was do actually just about, about that. to bring that up yeah you know there's a baby race so um <laughs> if you want to bring your fast baby down or maybe he's tough and rump and he can knock some people over or something like that it, it'd be kind of like a puppy bowl i think but right. with babies and racing to a finish line of some sort yeah I, I haven't seen it yet but i'm excited about that too so i cannot 
cannot wait to see. I'm just picturing the moms like holding the binky up, like, come on, go, go get it. I can't wait to see that. Mike, always a pleasure to have you. Thank you so much for thanks being for us. coming in, or thanks for having me in. I appreciate <laughs> yes. it. So thanks, Mike. Well, this has been Brood 8, brought to you by The Laughing Sun. And to try the Axe King or more, Laughing Sun is located at 1023 East Front Avenue in Bismarck. You can find more information about their food, drinks, and events by, of course, checking out their website or Facebook page.